Hey, what's up everybody? It is Uncle Mad here today. Big week we've had on the channel here. A lot of growth. We've talked about that already with some of the videos popping off. Uh, thanks to all those who have joined. Thanks to those who have been here for a while. I'm going to say that over and over again as we continue to grow. But with growth comes new opportunities. I've had several uh, companies starting to reach out to me about you know crossovers, business opportunities, things like that. I'll get into a little bit more of that on the live stream later this week. But one of the first ones to reach out to me that I looked at and said, this feels you know, normal, this doesn't feel like weird or shady or anything like that, was a company called Salad Power who reached out to me, wanted to send me some of their product, have me sample it on the channel, give my honest opinions about it, and everything seemed above board, everything seemed pretty cool. I was like, you know what, let's give it a shot. We've never done anything like this before. This is what comes with your channel's growth. And what's the point of having a YouTube channel if you can't just randomly do stuff like sample the product Salad Power has sent me today. Uh, let me tell you a little bit about more about what sa Salad. I don't keep want to say Salad Power. Salad Power. I'm not a good speaker of the English language. Is I'm going to read directly from the message they sent me about Salad Power. Salad Power stands out from the crowd by using real whole vegetables in our delicious beverage offerings. Unlike many other brands that rely on powdered alternatives, we are committed to the authenticity and goodness that comes from utilizing fresh, nutrient-rich vegetables in their natural form. But our commitment doesn't stop there. We are proud to share that our vegetables are sourced through organic farming practices by supporting the larger cause of expanding organic farming. With the limited availability of organic farming today, Every step towards promoting sustainable practices makes significant impact. Very interesting there. Very, very interesting. A couple other notes I wanted to share regarding salad power before we get into it. So they shared with me that one of the reasons they're so committed to organic growth, organic farming, is that in the U.S., and this is a crazy stat to me, only 0.85% of all farms are organic. That's less than 1%. Of farms. You go to the grocery store, you see in most grocery stores now we've got huge, you know, big organic food sections. So you think it'd be bigger than that, but less than 1% of all farms are organic. That's crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. And then once again, also the heavy thing they mentioned, it's 100% real whole vegetables, no powdered alternatives, nothing like that. Uh, I know one of the big ones in the market is AG1 Athletic Greens, and you know, they are a powder based one. This is 100% organic, all vegetables all you know good organic stuff but we're here to taste it we're here to see what it's really like now i'm not gonna lie a vegetable based smoothie is definitely not something that i would go out of my way to get this is not my uh normal forte my normal choice of food beverage consumption type things if you know me if you watch the channel i'm not that complicated of a guy, meat and potatoes, tacos, you know, pretty standard stuff. I don't, I don't go a little crazy with this stuff, but I mean, just, just look at what's in the package here. You've got 16 spinach leaves, 12 kale leaves, five carrots, four broccoli heads, half an apple, a quarter of a lemon, all in an eight ounce cold drink. So if you can get that much vegetable, that much nutrition in just one beverage, especially like, you know, right now, kind of breakfast time, start your day off right with that. I mean, Maybe it's something that I could become accustomed to because that's one thing. I don't eat breakfast much anymore because I'm so busy. A little quick shake, a little quick uh, bevy in the morning. Ch test it out. Have a go with it. Hit your day. You've got your vegetable intake for the day already done. Don't have to worry about that. Nothing to complain about there. But I think for me personally, I'm not a person who's ever going to put you know, taste over nutritional value. People who are heavy into nutrition, you know, obviously they can you know, do stuff that maybe I can't. But... Taste test to see how it is. That's what we're here to do. So, without further ado, let's get right into it. Serving size eight ounce, serving per container, one container, 90 calories, no fat, no cholesterol, 90 milligrams sodium, 21 grams of carbs. I'm reading these off like I know what any of this means. Like, you know, I try to act like uh, some kind of health professional and I don't know nothing, but we're going to try it. Actually, I'm going to get a cup. I'm going to pour a little bit into a cup so you can see what it actually looks like. All right, okay. I was expecting it to be green, but it's more of like a orangey, but that makes sense because there's carrots in there, so the carrots would kind of probably be what kind of overtook a lot of it. Carrot, spinach, apple, kale, broccoli, lemon. 
I like all those things, so I don't see any reason why I wouldn't like the combined benefits of them all rolled into one package. So without further ado, let's give it a shot. Bone apple teas, here we go. Hmm. So initial thoughts, texture is a little bit of a thing for me. Kind of hit me a little weird when the texture got to me a little bit. It's, you know, you can see here, it's kind of like a, I don't want to say baby food. That feels like the wrong way to describe it, but it's, it is more of a, like a, uh, kind of creamier, not as much juicy type drink. But the flavor's good. It's got all the, like, you can definitely taste all of this in there. So if you like all of these things, you would like it because flavor-wise, it's got all that stuff in there. Um, yeah, I mean, it's good for what it is. It, I would stick with that it's not something I would probably regularly buy, but this is, once again, not my type of thing. If you're a person who's big on vegetable smoothies, big on nutritional beverages and drinks, big on organic vegetables, I think you would love this. So Because if that's your wheelhouse, you know, this is, you know, I haven't tried many of these type of products, but when I've had before, most of the time I'm like, Bleh, gag, want to get rid of it right away. This, you know, I could drink this whole thing and enjoy it. Yeah. Hmm. I think the carrot, it makes sense why it's so orangey. The carrot comes across the strongest of any of the vegetables that I could see in there. One other thing that would be interesting that you could probably do with this is if you wanted to change the flavor pro pro profile, add something different to it. You could probably take this as a base for a smoothie and add some of your own ingredients that you wanted. Like if you've got protein powders that you want to throw in there or like maybe like a little chocolate protein to give it a little sweetness or something like that that might change the flavor pro profile. You could definitely do this if you just wanted to use this as a base for like your nutritional beverage that you drink to start your day. You could definitely do that, but I don't know. It's pretty good. It's pretty solid. Like I said, not something I would regularly get myself. It's, you know, but that's just me. That's my palate, my style of eating, my style of tasting stuff. But if you are someone who's looking for, you know, nutritional smoothies, nutritional foods, nutritional based opportunities, especially like something like this, like I said, you come in these little pouches, you grab one, hit it on your way to work in the morning, you've got your vegetable intake for the day. So, I mean, if you're somebody who's very focused on those type of things, this is probably right up your alley. So. If that's your style of thing, if that's something you'd be into, give Salad Power a try. There's going to be a link in the description down below. Uh, it's an affiliate link that'll let them know you found them through my channel. So helps Salad Power out, helps me out by just, you know, the partnership that we've kind of got going here. But that's it for this one. It's something very different than what we've ever done on the channel before. First time I've ever had like a uh, kind of almost like a sponsor, you know, co-promoted item here. But, you know, channel's growing. There could be more of this coming. Could be less of this coming. I've already, like I said, I've got a few others that have reached out where I've been like, eh, that's a little, uh, little shady. I'll talk about those on the live stream later this week. So if you want to catch some uh, more stories of what it's like to start getting contacted for business opportunities in the world of YouTube, uh, subscribe to the channel with the bell turn on for notifications so you get alerted when this week's live stream goes live because that's where I'll be talking about that. Um, otherwise, same usual contents coming to the channel. And like I said uh, in the video earlier this week, I was kind of do talking about the channel. The channel's just gonna be whatever I want it to be. Like whatever videos I wanna make, if I think there's something interesting worth making, making a video about, like trying salad power, I'm gonna do it. So if this is something you're interested in, seeing more random things like this, Nashville SC games, Titans games, went to the Tennessee State Fair this week, all the other stuff we do on the channel, I'm not gonna run off a list here, but subscribe, bell on for notification for more updates as they come daily, and get yourself some salad power. Thanks, Salad Power. Thank you to Salad Power for sending the product along. Hope this helps. We'll see you in the next one.